Okay, since you have a Mackie Pro FX V3 mixer, you got to go to the Mackie website, go to products, and find the Pro FX V3. Now you scroll all the way down. It's a long page, but go all the way down, and we're going to look for, look for a little bit further down. Here we go. USB drivers, the USB Windows driver. It downloads, and when it's done, go ahead and click on it and choose Run. I'm running this from a Mac, so it's a little different, but in Windows, you would just click Run, the setup.exe file, and it'll pop open, and you click Yes. And then we're going to wait for it to open up the actual driver install. You see the little wheel spinning next to my pointer, but there it is. Just click Next and click Install. And you sit back and it says waiting, but you just wait and give it some time and it'll install. If you look over there to the left, you can see where it says ProFX, driver is unavailable. Well, once this thing installs, it will be available. So just keep your eye on that the left of the setup window where it says other devices and it has pro effects it looks like a speaker and it says driver unavailable just wait you know for this driver to install it, it's going it's not waiting on you it's waiting to get itself together to to install so there it starts to go you can see the progress bar is moving to the right and if you look over there to the left you see the pro effects the unavailable is gone now so just wait for the driver to finish it's almost done, and once it's finished, we'll just click Next. See how Next is available for us? So we'll go down to Next, click it, and then click Finish. And now the driver is installed, and you can see over here, ProFX is installed. Let's move the window over so you can see it clearly, but uh, that window popped open as soon as I plugged in the USB cable into the, into the computer.